And once again, thank you so much for watching this video. My name is Kamen Sam on Twitter, and let's proceed. All right, so I'm going to look at background images, okay? And then I think I'll look at the uh, touchable opacity too. And then I think that will be good for us to start with our application and then some of the things that we can look at, such as the score view, uh, can come in with the next as we build our application. All right, so let me look at, um, I don't want to be a boring person talking and talking without activities. So, of course, let's import our image. If you still remember, so we had our image which had a self closing tag, okay? And it had a bind of one, a style, okay? And that style was equal to, okay? What was it equal to? It was equal to the width of the image, width of the image, okay? Which needed to be, which I make percentage of a hundred percent. And the reason for this error is because we lack a closing. We lack closing quotes, great. All right, so, and then our image is supposed to have a height. Okay, remember this, uh, I'm, I'm using commas here is because I'm doing inward styling for the uh, component. It's not for, it's not as, uh, so it comes with the component. And I'm going to give this, okay, this is supposed to be one. I'm going to give this 45%. All right, we okay. So apart from the style, we need to import the image. And the image, we're going to get it from the internet. So first of all, we need to have a source. Okay, so which source also needs some styling, which will equal to, okay, those tags, and you need to have a URI, which URI is provided in the link that I'm searching. So I'll go to unsplash.com. Right, so it's, since we are looking at baby me, I'll look at babies. And let me see what we have to provide. All right, I'll pick her. This is also a cute baby. And I copy the image address and then I come and paste it here. All right, so that is for the image. We have the image there. And there we go, we have our image. But remember last time we already learned about images and when I was introducing, I talked about background images. So this is supposed to be an image background, a background image. So image background. Okay. Not bad, but we need it to have a closing tag. So we'll do this and then do that. So which means we can put text in the middle there or any other component or be it a view. So what I can do, I can even add a button. Okay. And then I put the title for the button. Maybe press me. And I save. There you go. Okay, so you can see it's on top of the image. Well, I can even put a text. Okay. <clears throat> Let me put a view now so that that view contains the button name. So let me put another view. And that view contains the button and the text. So we're going to have a text here that says this is a baby. All right, so there it is. Uh, on top of the image, of course, you know, we can do our styling and this is a double style because it's, it, does, it doesn't it uh, does come with the component itself. It's not bound, all right? So where we can have a font size, a font size, 
of uh, 34 and then the color can be white uh, there is already a mistake there i'm supposed to terminate instead of commas okay then let me save that all right and that's it with our image background in the next video we're going to look at uh, touchable opacity when you want to press the image or you want the image to do something for you and then i think we shall be ready to start with our application as soon to the few components that we looked at thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe like comment share donate uh thank you for being my patreon